Hey Star Wars fans and action figure collectors, we've got another Black Series review for you today. It is Miggs Mayfeld, based on his outfit from Morak. Um, and I'll be the first to be honest and say that... Oh, I won't be the first. But I'll be honest and say I would have preferred his Season 1 sort of outfit, or even his change of clothes after he gets out of the armor at the end of the, uh, the episode from Season 2. But, you know, it's, it still looks like a great figure. We're getting... Um, in Jaren to go with him at some point and uh, we're getting them in three and three quarter inch scale as well so so this is Bill Burr's character as you can see on the side of the box great likeness there of old Billy a very funny funny comedian I enjoy Bill Burr's com comedy a lot so yeah a hot headed ex-imperial sharpshooter Miggs Mayfeld was once the smart-mouthed leader of a gang of criminals. Mayfeld's skills and old ties helped the Mandalorian on his mission to rescue Grogu from Moff Gideon. So, looks like a cool figure. I uh, Much like the Cosca Reeves that came out uh, last year, I wish it wasn't helmeted in the package. Just because we have no idea what the face is going to look like underneath when we get this, until we get it out of the box. Um, and being that there have been occasional QC issues with the uh, the photo rule, even you know, it, while it looks great, sometimes they just don't line up perfectly. So, fingers crossed that this one looks good underneath. From all the samples and reviews I've seen, they're all looking pretty good. Um, so yeah, let's open it up and have a look. All right, here he is out of the packaging, and I'm just going to give him a 360 before we do the unhelmeted reveal. <laughs> there we go so um, yeah we'll try and get him to stand up if not I'll just use, him, use my hands to make him spin around so yeah using most parts from the Mud Trooper from Solo um, so at its base this figure is a few years old but a worthy, worthy reuse yeah I'm just going to hold it because this thing sucks <laughs> it's just not the best surface so yeah, it's uh, mostly using parts from the Mud Trooper from Solo, and uh, unfortunately, because all my toys are in storage, I don't have one at hand to compare. Um, I feel like maybe the skirt part here um, at the end is, at the bottom there, is a new piece. Um, obviously, they've got the spot for there for the breathing gear, and uh, you know, the helmet is a new cast of a figure which we saw with the AT tank driver, whatever it is. Um, so yeah, we've just I, we've just shown old Billy's Billy's face here. So let's get a close up look. Of old Billy. Host of the Monday morning podcast. Be nice if it focused a little bit. There we go. So that's a really good lightness. He's got that slight little smirk there that Bill Burr has. This looks good. I feel like probably needs a little bit of fuzz on the head, just a very light sprinkling of fuzz, but you know, he's completely bald here, so that's okay. You know, it's that's pretty damn good. I'm not gonna complain about very small details like <laughs> you know basically a five o'clock shadow on the top of his head so not bad at all oh, I like the colors of this thing I love the mud trooper design I love the outfits I'm looking forward to the Din Djarin version I know they're both coming out in vintage collection I'm pretty sure they've said that it's going to be coming out in black series so a yeah, nice looking armor so one thing I've loved about the new era of Star Wars is the additions to the Imperial Army, the different troopers. We've seen so many different troopers come out and really build on that empire and all the different armor sets that they have for different, different missions and different environments. I think it's great. So there he is, Migs Mayfeld. This is a cool figure. You get the light just right. You just looks like they just nailed that face, you know. Like I'm so glad I got a good paint sample on this one. 
just depending where you get the lighting it really just catches it in the right place fantastic yeah he's going to be uh, displayed with his helmet off so really nice details obviously the blaster pistol that will fit in the holster there it's the same blaster pistol that come with um, Dr. Everzan that I reviewed uh, just last week. So yeah, nice stuff. Please send in the comments, let me know what you think. Hope you enjoyed this review. Thank you very much for tuning in. If you enjoyed it, please give the little thumbs up a, a little clicky. And uh, if you're not subscribed, please do. Always appreciate the uh, the support. And uh, I've got a couple more figures to review, so stay tuned to the channel for over the next couple of days for those. Um, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Till the next video, may the force be with you always.